Hey guys, make sure you stand till the end. If you make one common mistake, you may end up spending hundreds, even thousands of dollars on parts and diagnostics you don't need. Make sure you stand till the end. We will explain what we are talking about. Hey guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you guys having a Chevy Tahoe, this generation right here from year 2006 to year 2014. If you have one of those, <coughs> if you need to find where the fuse for the cigarette lighter is located, which two fuses, by the way, you will need to check, where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, realize at a good price, quick shipping, that way you do not waste your money and time. And why it's important to always guys test fuses and realize all that guys will be covered absolutely free for your convenience make sure to stand till the end so before we start let us tell you a little bit about us guys if you have a chevy tahoe or suburban practically they're built on the same platform we'll be making a video about every single fuse relay in that suv why because let's say you're down the road you need to find where the fuse for fuel injectors fuel pump ignition coils is located that way you can fix your suv and be back on the road we will have that information you'll just spend a minute or two watching the video fix it and it will take care of that problem now every single car we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos we take them guys completely apart we show you how to do engines transmissions mechanical body work and we have more than 12,000 free repairs on our youtube channels that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs in addition guys if you need to buy any parts tools fuses relays at a really good price quick shipping that way do not waste your money and time we will put the links in the description of the video below for your convenience so let's start on it now so now the re uh, the cigarette lighter guys fuse okay that's for the front okay cigarette lighter we'll demonstrate on that generation chevy tahoe here you guys have three different fuse boxes in that suv and today we work in two of them now uh you want to know the first one is practically on the driver's side open the door guys here on the side you have a cover of the dash go ahead and remove it behind it you will find that fuse box layout here before we continue let's explain why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays so now why it's super important guys to test fuses and relays because often you may think you have a good fuse right but uh, it could be guys a bad fuse sometimes it's really hard to tell it's hard to see you have different kinds of fuses and each one of those guys it, let's say you think it's a good fuse but it's actually bad you may end up spending time money on parts and uh, repairs that you don't need so always test fuses it takes only uh, a few seconds we'll put a link to a special video that will teach you how to test fuses and how to test relays as well relays are easy to test uh, that way you can eliminate that possibility for something uh, that uh, that's not necessary guys so check out the links will be in the description of the video below for the cigarette lighter here you have one fuse then we need to go to a different fuse box we come like that one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen fuse number sixteen right here guys that 20 amp fuse is the one that you need to check then you need to pop the hood open once you do that okay uh, you will see under the hood on the right side you have a fuse box under this cover go ahead open it and behind it you will find a fuse box layout that will look like this one this is the front of the Chevy Tahoe this is the windshield side passenger side driver side now here we will need to check guys okay uh, one more fuse specifically you wonder where okay if we zoom in in that corner here we're talking about this fuse which is fuse number 53 guys okay right here you will need to check that one if you have any questions don't hesitate to let us know thank you for watching see you next time